okay we have it you can see that not all russian women are so good in the kitchen and she said like okay come at uh, 8 p.m to this but why vladivostok is so expensive i don't know because i see these apartments more of them are so ugly hey guys uh, i'm here with you again so youtube is still working so we can uh, make some videos uh, and today uh, why i decided to make this video because uh, on sunday we, uh, we have easter and um, as you know we have it a bit later than you uh, in our culture and uh, we have tradition to color to paint eggs uh, and uh, today we will do it together if you think that I've done it before and no I never done it uh, that will be my first time and today I bought this this strange uh, thing uh, look what we will do uh, we will do this um, I don't know how to call them these people these dolls it it uh, they they wrote uh, here that uh, that's like uh, Russian traditions. So maybe that's uh, national Russian uh, clothes. Yeah, I think uh, it looks like this. Uh, so first thing that we should do is to paint eggs. Um, I will take uh, maybe ten eggs. Okay, we have it. Okay, I think we will do it. Let's see how many eggs we can do with it. And yeah, why we do it today? Today is Thursday, Monday Thursday, Holy Thursday, Clean Thursday. I don't know, there are different names of this day. My mom said that I should do it in this day. So like, uh, let's do it uh, like uh, traditionally we do. Um, Okay, guys, I see that we have uh, this, all these things just for six dolls, maybe. So I would say that's not much. Mm, yeah, yeah, we can do six dolls. Uh, okay, other eggs will be just colored. First thing that we should do. Uh, guys, we should boil eggs. We should boil eggs. You know, every time when I boil eggs, uh, they can break. So, um, okay, <laughs> I check it. So we need uh, ten minutes um, to boil eggs. Yeah, so ten minutes we will boil eggs, and uh, this time we we can speak with you. important thing eggs should be um, not broken they should be not broken because uh, on Sunday we will play a game uh, we will we will take two eggs and do like this and uh, the person who will have a normal egg after that not broken is like a big, uh, like a winner so, uh, now I can tell you what happened in my life. Um, actually, everything is fine, I would say. Uh, I work, um, I finished my course now. So I started uh, doing uh, coach sessions with my students. Now I'm sure I think how to continue my blogging and everything. So, um, and also I'm doing sports. I'm doing sports, I'm doing Tabata. Tabata, that's like fitness, fitness, aerobica, I don't know. And also, I tried to find an apartment in Vladivostok, now I live with my parents. Uh, when I uh, came back from Sochi, um, I live uh, with my parents, so I want to live alone. And now I look for an apartment. Uh, I wouldn't I won't say that that's not easy because um, you can rent apartment with an agency for maybe one year um, but you need to pay commission like 100% like 80% to this uh, agency um, 
I try to find uh, people who, who I can rent apartment. Um, I found uh, some apartments that I like, but you know, people took it just in some hours. Uh, so I check this site every day, I don't know, every hour, if people will um, give good apartments with a normal look, because I want to have a space that I will like, you saw that my room <laughs> looks really good. Uh, so I would like uh, to find maybe one room apartment, uh, not big, but in normal area if, of Vladivostok. And uh, um, oh, I just want that it look good. Mm, normal apartment uh, in normal area cost around uh, 30,000 travels or maybe like... Um, like it will be like mm, with everything like four four hundred fifty dollars in months maybe or five hundred dollars it can cost sure i would like to tr to find something cheaper guys i would say that that's really expensive for russia that's expensive because that's uh, prices that you can find in saint petersburg or maybe even in moscow in sochi i rented apartment small small apartment maybe uh, also for 400 travels but that's that's like the best cities of russia the biggest city is uh, sochi you know that's like a resort city city sure it will be expensive but why vladivostok is so expensive i don't know because i see these apartments more of them are so ugly uh, not in the best area and uh, they are really expensive you know, four hundred dollars, five hundred dollars. That's like uh, the middle salary in Russia. <laughs> so in other territories uh, of Russia, sure you can rent apartment cheaper, much cheaper, maybe for um, I saw three hundred dollars. Here you also can do, but that will be something super, super, super bad. You know, in the house where a lot of uh, not uh, normal people with alcoholics and everything everything um, so sure i would like to live in normal place uh, and now i don't know what to do because i don't want to rent apartment for the whole year because um i don't know maybe in october if a uh, situation will be good i would like uh, to go, go to sochi or to another city that will be warmer again but I don't know what will be. So we have... Okay, still too early. And um, I don't know if I will find the apartment in this month that's good. If I won't find, maybe I will still live with my parents and then just leave Vladivostok again in autumn. Maybe I will do like this. Uh, we will see. Because if I will... Um, have documents for apartment for one year if i will leave with you early i will need to pay like extra money and everything will be more complicated uh ensure some problems now with planes with everything uh, air and b and b blocked uh, so uh also kind of dangerous to rent apartment in another city and you cannot see apartment so now my my head is like this anyway uh summer in, in vladivostok i would say that's good uh june will be as always misty maybe even july uh, may is fine august is fine september is very good also so after that i hope uh, i will travel i would like to travel uh, i came back i come back from Sochi in uh, January because of some reasons uh, I couldn't uh, stay there but mm, I believe that everything will be for the best uh, so we will see how it will be so we are waiting <laughs> so we are we are waiting for 10 minutes uh, so <laughs> I will tell you a funny story uh, some days ago I found very good apartment, very nice in the center. Uh, I saw this, uh, this apartment 
just 15 minutes later after she posted this uh, uh, post about this room I called her and um, she said like okay come at uh, 8 p.m. to this address uh, to this uh, apartment I will show you apartment and uh, but I didn't understand that before me and the other people's address uh, to this uh, apartment I will show you apartment and uh, but I didn't understand that before me and the other people see apartment um, and <laughs> I came with Tanya to the center uh, we came to this uh, for this house I called her and she said okay I will show apartment to another family now and uh, we we waited for uh, our turn with Tanya <laughs> near the balcony <laughs> um, and then uh, I called her she said okay you okay, can wait please um, she turned on the light in apartment and then And then, then we decided uh, like to come to the shop, to the store, grocery store with Tanya, uh, just to wait because it was really cold outside. <laughs> so, uh, in, already it was maybe 20 minutes uh, after that. There I called her, uh, and then we go out from this shop. The shop is really, really expensive because it was the like the center, the center of Vladivostok, uh, and I see that uh, the light already turned out, <laughs> and I understand that they have just left the apartment and even didn't call me back. So I called her. She said hello. Apartment already rented by people before you, uh, and everything like this. Uh, after that, I remember I called one person. Uh, like uh, we also uh, already chose the time when we meet with him and two minutes later I see in the side that he changed the price of uh, the apartment he made it much bigger so I called him back he said yes I changed the price that's all so Vladivostok I would say <laughs> the city where you should be really careful about everything because Vladivostok is very uh, popular because of it because not all people are super responsible you know uh, so yeah uh, just some sad stories but I think maybe that's for the best maybe I don't need to rent the apartment now here in Vladivostok maybe I will go to another city or something so we will see what will be next okay guys so what I see I see that uh, some eggs already broken <laughs> guys I don't know maybe I maybe I took too, uh, maybe I took too many eggs and they like broke each other okay I have some more eggs we will boil them too and <laughs> if they will be broken I will go to buy new eggs that's really sad but how we say in Russia it means that not everything uh, what you do will work from the first time so <laughs> other eggs I will eat for breakfast tomorrow as I understand <laughs> Okay, uh, so we have uh, three colors and now we need to prepare that for this X. We need to take three, I don't know, three cups or something and uh, put it there. So, uh, what we do now, uh, as I said, we have three colors. Uh, we need to take uh, hot water and uh, uksus. How to say uksus? What that was? <laughs> uh, so I take two, uh, three cups, three cups, we have three colors. So we have uh, yellow color. Ah, that's not, that's even not yellow. I will show you now. That's even orange. Yeah, like this. You see, orange. Uh, then we have blue one and 
pink. They all this is pink. Pink color. Pink color looks looks a bit red. <sighs> now I read uh, we need uh, like uh, to put there um, like the cup of uh, hot water and to add also this. Okay. So now we take the egg and put it there for two or four minutes. Not all eggs are beautiful. I would I would say that all eggs are ugly, but let's try. Okay. Like this. I just hope that <laughs> my, my eggs are boiled. <laughs> it will be very sad if they are not. Okay. Blue one. You can see that not all Russian women are so good in the kitchen and you can see it in, with my example. Так, okay, I have color everywhere. My mom will kill me. Так. Okay, so now I understood for what I needed goals. Uh, так, so I have one. Okay, guys, that looks not bad. <laughs> we continue. Um, the problem is this. You see, they are broken. That's off. So, uh, we have eggs now. You see? <laughs> uh, in the end, I decided to mash a yellow and blue and we have one green egg. <laughs> So some of them are broken, uh, but now uh, we will uh, do what? We will do something very strange, but I hope it will be beautiful. So we have like, we have like clothes or what is it? I don't know. Um, for this eggs. Mm -hmm. um, so now we need to do it. For example, we should take one egg. Let's take one. Okay, this. Let's take this pink egg. Um, так, so it should be beautiful together. I think this one. Um, Should I do now? Should I? I think so. I should take this. Back. And and what? Ah, and then and do like this or what? Like this. Yeah, like this. <laughs> um, I don't know if you see or no. So now we have this, and your your hands should be they should be here. Like I'm a bit crazy, but yeah, I do this. 
Ой, так. Господи. Он же прикрепился. А, не, я нос был здесь. So, her nose will be right under. Guys, what do you think about this? <laughs> Or... <sighs> Guys, what do you think about this? Does it look strange? <sighs> mm. So, what do you think about <laughs> this? <laughs> do you like it or no, guys? <laughs> Does it look crazy? <laughs> How do you think? Uh, I forgot, I forgot, I can... My nails are too long, so for me it's difficult to do this. Go. Okay, guys, so <laughs> I finished doing this. Um, that looks not typical, not like typical legs, but <laughs> that's just fine. So, uh, in comments, don't forget to tell uh, how you celebrate uh, Easter in your country, maybe in your um, family, you have special traditions. It will be interesting for me to read and uh, other guys also can read it. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. Uh, now you can, uh, you can find me in Telegram. I will uh, give the link to my Telegram channel so we can speak there about uh, anything.